When I really got turned on to playing bass with Jaco Pastorius, I heard that first self-titled record and that blew my mind. And later on it was guys like John Patitucci. When I was young I really liked Talen Carano, I used to listen to him. Marcus Miller, Victor Wooden, and the jazz guys, upright guys, guys like Ron Carter and uh, Ray Brown. Definitely a lot of Ray Brown I was listening to. My dad was very hard on that. He's like, you want to play bass, you got to play some piano too. So we'd hang out a lot around the piano, and the bass was like my reward for that kind of. Yeah, so, but it definitely helped. A lot of the stuff that I do now, I could not have done if you hadn't shown me piano stuff and harmony stuff that you can really get if you play piano or guitar. The best thing about the BB-1X is I could really get the tone of my bass come through it. It wouldn't change the way I play, it wouldn't change the way the, the notes are coming out and they sound exactly how my bass would sound if I just plug into a uh, direct, into a great like Avalon or something like that. The drive, I guess if you kind of want to rock out or like have a different tone. I, I actually like that fuzzy kind of tone. I, I dig that. I like it. Boss pedals are like the, it's the high standard of, of pedals. It's like the example I guess all the other companies kind of, you know, look at. And for me, uh, the pedals I've had I've had them for six or seven years, and I've been beating them down, trust me. And they still work great. They clear as the first day. They just look dirty from my shoe, but other than that, they sound great. 